May I speak with Jeff Settleson, please? Yes, it's that time. Jeff? Dan Landsman. Dan. Dan. From high school. I want to talk reunion with you. 20 years, can you believe it? That's not very mature. The ocean and the sun, both beautiful, both deadly. Stacy, Honey? Oliver Lawless. From high school? Yes, from high school on a national commercial. He did it. He made it. Zach, that was one of Daddy's good friends. No, really? It was not. Three, Hang seven, up the bones. D Fresh has an idea. Who's D Fresh? It's me, Jerry Focus. Is that Oliver Lawless? The ocean, I can yes. He's a big Hollywood actor now. We get Lawless to come, the whole class will follow him. It's like one of those charity events. They bring out the celebrities. If Dave Schwimmer goes, everyone goes. Dan? Dude, yeah, hey. what's up? Oh, yeah. I got us a couch. Yeah, let's sit at the bar. Oh. He's the banana boat guy. Banana boat. That guy is this guy, and this guy is that guy. Ask me why I'm here, Oliver. I'm here for your business meeting. That's what my boss, who's sleeping right above us, thinks. I came here to get you to come to our high school reunion. Jesus. You were taking a muscle relaxing before. Down the old hatch. Mimosa? You earned it, Dan boy. Mimosa? What about Lawless? Is he gonna come to the reunion? Lawless. Lawless RSVP. And then a bunch of others RSVP. There he is. What happened in LA? Dan, it's in the past. <laughs> Dan, I don't know how you did it, man, but you bagged yourself a good one. Uh -huh. right? Has something changed that I'm not aware of? I mean, maybe we should talk about it. I thought if I could deliver Oliver Lawless, I'd be a hero, single-handedly saving our reunion. How about this? D-nice. What? Have people just call me that from now on? This reunion is for everybody. It's for all of us, not just him! You're obsessed with Oliver? What is going on with you? You're acting so weird. Talk to me! What do you want to talk about, Dan? Oliver, wait, why did the music stop? Man, what a missed opportunity to make a special film here about how high school not only casts its shadow over us after we leave, but that it's very easy to be pulled right back to that same place emotionally. You know, Hollywood makes so many movies about high school, but I think they rarely explore what the ramifications of that experience are. And there was one line I liked in this trailer uh, where Jack Black uh, loses his temper and he says, you know, this reunion isn't just for him, uh, you know, this popular guy, it's for all of us. This is supposed to be something that benefits everybody in the class. And I thought that was a really genuine, raw emotion. And throughout the trailer, I kept waiting for the movie to really go there, beyond that single line. And it never did. Uh, it also didn't seem to hint at the fact uh, that, uh, you know, James Marston would perhaps reveal that high school wasn't a walk in the park for him. For some reason, it was fixated on this blank period of time during the trip where Jack Black recruits him for the reunion, you know, in a hangover type way. Like, what happened when I blacked out? Why did you agree to come? Uh, you know, maybe, maybe it'll be some heart-to-heart -heart discussion they had about high school, and that's why James Marston decided to come. Uh, but, you know, I think that's something they should give away in the trailer and, you know, the, the tension and the, 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 the uh, you know, the stakes or whether or not Jack Black's character will uh, realize they had that conversation. And, you know, we know where James Morrison is coming from. So maybe that we understand some of the things Jack Black is saying to him are hurtful or Jack Black's misperceptions are wrong. I mean, I'm all for a twist, but when you have a twist, you really need to look at it and say, you know, is this all about the twist? You know, look what happened to M. Night Shyamalan for evidence on how that is not a good plan. Uh, and, you know, how does this affect the rest of the movie? You know, if you can't get people to watch the first, you know, three quarters of your movie, they won't be there for when the twist happens to have their, uh, you know, my, uh, mind quote unquote blown. Uh, so I think this movie's taking a huge gamble, uh, and I hope it's not the missed opportunity that it seems like, because I think all the elements are there. And again, as I said, Hollywood is so fixated on high school, but they rarely pay attention to, you know, what life is like after high school. I think the most recent film I can, uh, you know, think that comes to mind like that is Young Adult by Jason Reitman with Charlize Theron. Uh, and that, 
you know, had a lot of other baggage that it was dealing with and a lot of other things that Reitman and Diablo Kobe wanted to say. Uh, you know, that was more about the popular girl having, you know, like a, a reckoning or, you know, personal revelation. But I think something that's more all-encompassing like this with people who aren't as damaged as Charlene Theron's character would, I think, be more powerful. Because, you know, you see, like, the character in Young Adult and you're like, well, that's not me. But I think everyone can relate at some point to the characters being portrayed here. And I also like Mike White. This is a good use of Mike White. I thought he really stole the show, the trailer, just the trailer, with some of his really deadpan line readings. I thought just the way he said, oh, isn't that, isn't that so-and-so from high school when they were watching the commercial, you know, all together? I was like, wow, that was so realistic. You know, you really, you really made that line resonate. Uh, and also because, you know, clearly this guy hadn't made as big an impression on Mike White's character in high school as it had on Jack Black. So, uh, again, I think this looks like a missed opportunity. I hope I'm wrong. At the very least, it's a horribly cut trailer. So I'm curious, what do you think of this trailer? And what do you think of the idea of Hollywood exploring high school uh, from, you know, in the rearview mirror, you know, post high school? All right, thank you so much for tuning into my review. I look forward to discussing this trailer with you down below. And you can check out some other episodes right now.